So you're in with my form again, and I've got my uh, generic clean function here. Um, if I want to get a little bit more specific to certain types of input, um, there are some filters I can apply that already do some of these kind of things, um, but with specific types of outputs in mind. So for example, let's say this box is supposed to collect an email address. Well, instead of writing my generic clean, I can filter um, using a, an existing filter, and the function call is called filter var. It takes two parameters, the thing you'd like to clean off, and then a constant representing what kind of clean I want to apply. So I'm going to filter, sanitize this, can't spell sanitize, and then I want to make this cleaned as an email. All right, um, I think I have an extra parentheses right here. All right, so let's go check this out. So here's my input box. Let's put some weird stuff. So some commas, Bethany uh, at, at gmail.com. And when this submits, it gets rid of stuff that would make this an illegal email address. Okay. I can also use this in concert with another filter um, that doesn't just clean it but checks if it's now legit so let me right here I can apply this again in a slightly different way so if the filter of this variable stuff using the constant called filter validate email if that gives me a true then I know for sure oops, get curly in here then I know for sure that this guy is a people email okay um else not oops let's see if that works so here we go so gmail.com here we go it's not a legal email